There's not going to be any intro music this time. Uh, this is an ad hoc stream and doesn't get a title card. Besides which, the Hummelmon title screen is kind of cool. This, kind of, this is part of the mod pack. This is a fairly extensive mod pack, although it is mostly performance stuff. Besides Cobblemon 1.4, which it just came out like today, everybody's been very excited about it. Um, it's mostly it, it's all quality of life or. Um, performance enhancing, there's, there's better biome blend and, uh, clean cut and cola sleeves, apple skin, which is a nice little one to have, but then you get stuff like lithium and iris and so forth in order to support the complementary shaders, because there are shaders in this mod pack. It actually came with shaders in the mod pack this time. I've been battling Zero, trying to get my Zero maps, my Zero world map, copy over. Because what's happened here? Hey, Terry Opossum, welcome. Greetings, good to see you. Hope the drawing is going well. <clears throat> so what what what's happened here is there's no multiple server instances, there is a Nexus instance that you, sp you spawn into, and then you go to a Reality Selector, and you can zip over to Prime Valley, which throws you to the previous server game world, uh, where everybody's stuff still is. I've already been there, made sure everything was cool. Everything's very different. Uh, there's been some texture remaps and such, we'll get to that in a minute, but... Yeah, um, cannot seem to get my Zero world map to copy over from the single instance, you know, you, you log in and, okay, this is the world you're in, to one with the world selector, and getting on my nerves. Let's just get into this. This is Minecraft 1.20.1, and and we're about to go into Dynasty MC. This may take a few tries. I am. There are still some connection issues here. There we go. Usually takes me four or five times. It's been taking me four or five tries to get in each time. Yes, there will be a lot of Mojang logo screens. There are resource packs and shaders and all sorts of oops, hi. Uh let's um walk that. Okay, that's Zelenar, that's a player, that's Mom. Uh who is for some reason aboard the ship. This is um a luxury liner that we are aboard right now. We're using the complementary shaders here, so we're getting some nice lighting effects. We have a, of course, there has to be a, a battle area. There's our PC. All our Pokemon. Over and switch out a couple things. I'm going to switch this. And... I sh they nerfed the shoulder carry with this uh, release, and I am very upset about that. Um, let's just go with this. All right. Moving on, let's go to the reality selector and see if the zero maps were loaded. If not... I'm just going to have to give up on copying, getting them copied over, and accept that I'm I'm going to have to start over. Okay, here's where we are now, the Nexus of Realities. Prime Valley, that's the previous server game world. New Horizon, haven't looked into it yet. 
And this will eventually be Pestilence Plains, which is a giant Pokemon boss battle zone. Probably won't be going there. Not my thing. Okay. Cross connecting. Resource pack loading. Let's load. Sorts of processing hap. It's taking a lot longer to get to the game world where I'm playing this time. Here we go. There we are. Okay, this is my base. This is the longhouse. Step outside. I'm gonna bring up world map. God damn it. I have lost the mapping. And I have to I'm starting from scratch on the mapping. That really irritates the snot out of me. But I just don't i I've tried four or five different ways of getting it the zero data copied over and it just doesn't want it. This is kinda cool though. Because it's tagging all the mons as to what they are. That's kind of kind of cool. This whole area is more or less mine. Um, my base here. Somebody else is over here. Not claimed area, but this is where I've got all my lumber growing. The village of Beesburg, which we'll visit in a moment. That whole area is a one big claim. So the whole village is under protection. And down here is uh, the underwater city of Ilan Timmel with the Nemo Dome, and we'll get to that in a few. All right. First things first, let's go have a look at the game world here. We are right now facing tonight. I actually want to go around the other direction. Start hunting for berries because there are... 69 varieties of berries that went in with this update. Excuse me. Yes, there was a lot of it. Nice. Poking around up in here to see if there's any berries uh, that have spawned in, seeing anything right off. Now there's a step up here. There's only one way this works. There we go. Kind of poke around real quick. See if anything interesting. Yeah. I'm gonna stop there. Let's just bang back to here to the longhouse. And go check out how things looked in here. The glass has been retextured and is much more transparent now which has really messed with the look of my underwater city. Um, sort of a good news, bad news thing. This is just the kelp closet. I grow my own kelp. Well, you never know when you get supply. So, yeah, this is doing, this is pretty long. A lot of processing to do. I could do stone. I'm going to go on and run on this just to, partly to see what it looks like. Partly to see what mons are now spawning down in the subway. You do
Ooh. Yeah. You didn't drop any pebbles. That's interesting. There was no currency drop. Gained essence from us uh, from a sword, but huh? Interesting. Okay, that's a lot more, that seems a lot more transparent uh, with the shaders. The water is almost not even visible, so it's interesting. Some significant changes with 1.4, the apricorn trees are no longer green. They're much easier to spot in the wild as a result. This is nice. Um, not seeing any new mines off here. Not expecting to see a whole lot here. Whoops, what's that up on the top of the wall? Okay. Is that a lechonk? Is that a pig up on top of my wall? There is a pig on my wall. What the heck was the pig doing up on top of the wall like that? Good. The good news is you can't get out. I was a little concerned. I put that block there to keep the villagers from wandering out. Okay, that's the first new Pokemon of uh, the new Pokemon. There's 188 new Pokemon introduced with this update. It's. If it's been a thing. Alright. Beesburg looks like it did before the update. Not gonna be too concerned. Let's do the water view. I'm not teleporting here because I want to check out the uh, minecart network. See what spawns down here before we go to let the. Uh, at some point. Yeah, we're going to Lithium. We'll see what it looks like now. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, shoot. Scat. Dagnabbit. Gotta be some way to keep the Pokemon off the tracks.
Okay. This gets really trippy with the new transparent glass uh, here. Welcome to Ilan Timmel. There is glass there. Yes. But wow, you is substantially more spectacular now. the Nemo Dome. Okay. Let's ignore that Dozo. Move on. He won't, that Onyx will not fit into this tunnel. Just having a quick walk around and seeing how things look and how everything's driving. Uh-oh. Well, somebody didn't, uh, Oh. All right. Careful. There's an underwater view. Wow. Okay, the, the new texture on the glass really makes a massive difference. It's so much more transparent that it's at times hard to tell it's there. Unfortunately, I cannot put my whooper on my shoulder to go out into the water as I was doing because the 1.4 update nerfed shoulder carry. All of the effects of shoulder carry have been removed. The devs decided that the implementation was broken and the whole thing was coming out way OP and so they just pulled the whole thing to rethink it. In the meantime, I cannot get water breathing uh, without a potion. Previously, I could have stuck a um, whoop around my shoulder and just had water breathing for as long as I wanted, which is, of course, the OP part. You know, it was an in... The shoulder effect, uh, carry gave me an, a... an, an a non-expiring potion. Hmm. Potion of infinite duration, which, yeah, I can see that being a bit of a problem. It was being a little bit of a problem in some of the competitions, because some of the uh, players would put a speed Pokemon on their shoulder and be able to outrun everybody. Okay, this is all going fine. Let's get the minecart taken back to Beesburg, and then I'm going to teleport using the warp, community warp, to Lithia. Yeah, I, I agree. Um, I could not have built the Nemo Dome without infinite, without the water breathing effect from the whooper. Um, potions would have just been prohibitively expensive for, for getting that done. I don't even know how to make the potion because it's something ridiculous to get. <clears throat>
uses puffer fish, which I can go buy at a shop. I don't have to fish for them. Uh, one of the nice things about uh, this uh, server is that it's it's in peaceful mode, and so to make some things available, there there have to be shops. So I can go to the casino where the boat crates are and you know all the various item crates which you can buy keys for. Uh, there's a marketplace that sells Pokemon Evolution items and Pokemon vitamins and uh, all the different items, all the different materials that uh, Mons will drop uh, when defeated. And then there's a rare items one where you can buy some various other stuff. So well, yeah, I could just go buy puffer fish, but that would get pricey. And at eight minutes a potion, that would get really tedious really fast. Okay, let's see. Port PP Community Lithia City. Ooh, You're oh wow. Haha, <laughs> the new glass uh, does some interesting things for our water vaders. They have re-sculpted the onyx. There's a lot more vertical, and it coils, and there's a lot less tail hanging out. Previously, it was just a long sandworm-looking thing. Yeah, they've they it takes up a lot less horizontal space now and rears up vertical a lot bigger. Sturdy. Come on, minerals. Yeah. Salt lake, whatever. <clears throat> Mineral bull mineral block you put out in the pasture. Oh, that's another thing. It's supposed to be pasture blocks now so that you can, like, set designated areas that your Pokemon can wander in. <clears throat> Would be useful for things, I mean, if you're raising uh, mud braids or ponytots or something where you could put them in a paddock. This is all, so much of this is under claim at this point. I just don't hit quite have all the blocks I need to, to finish it off. But, um, shouldn't be a problem here. I'm seeing pretty much the same stuff as previous. I'm going to go top side. Lithia City is very deep underground, yes. Okie doke, here we are in Arctic. Get used to it, it's a key now. Oh, we got, we got uh, Boizels and Zubats, Weird Deer, Swinub. Furret, Krabby, Kingler, Dupiter, Magikarp, Whalemers. Oh, Whalemers. Save me. 
whale lord in this particular Pokemon mod is the size of Whalemer we ought to be. Hey, here's our weird deer. Well, that wasn't very effective. Now this. <clears throat> oh, hey. Cool. This isn't really any different here. Hey, I heard you moving around back there. And now our shiny Ghibli is now a shiny Gibbite. Fine. IVs are kind of crap. I'm evolving it because it's a shiny and I want to have the, have the fully evolved shiny. Okay. Seeing pretty much the same stuff here, but Stantler's got a little more animation to him. Yeah, I like the head turn there. Okay. Let's go up into the mountain here and see if any new plants have appeared. I'm going to be doing the Linnaeus thing and just going back and forth across the land looking for any plant I have not seen before. There are a lot. There's... Vivichokes, there's a bunch of different kinds of mint, there's the aforementioned berries. I'm just wondering. <laughs> Any of that is going to appear. <coughs> Part of the problem is that so much of this world has already been visited by players. It may be a problem. I don't know if the new stuff will spawn into existing territories. that with the loss of the, ma of the mapping, I have no idea what's, what is this direction. I'm going to see if I can, I'm trying to find warmer climbs, but I'll do a, a village up there. Oh boy. Here's somebody's thing. You know what? Why? Let's see if I can slap a uh, real car down on there. here. No! Don't do that. Stop that. Oh, dang it. I gotta go fix that. Well, that uh, idea didn't work. 
Now I gotta go repair somebody else's rail that I just busted. I can find where I, there it is. There's star flip. Okay, I have found a town, it looks like. This place is this. Again, is there anything here? Oh, okay. Now I know where I am. I'm in Canada. <laughs> do have my markers. Now that's interesting. I have all these markers, but I don't have the maps. Add edit, we're going to just say Canada and confirm. And then I'm going to drag it down to the, there. Okay. And This is still frozen wilderness. Let's... Well, let's go on and, uh... <clears throat> get Punsville onto the map here. I'm going to need it at some point. I've got a subway that at some point, theoretically, will terminate in here. I'm beginning to wonder if I'm going to have to go over to the New Horizons world. <coughs> you want at least... Oh my! Look at that. A girder. That's a new one. Gotcha. Of a ball. With my Vaporeon being level 100, the level ball is actually uh, one of my better options for capturing pretty much anything. I get a bonus based on level differential. Ok, 
Okay, I had to go down past the ship. I remember that. I'm pretty well convinced that, um... I'm going to have to go over to the New Horizons world to see about things like berries. Is this where I turn? No. This is early. We gotta turn here where there's all the lights. Just not singing a Doug trio on a bridge. <laughs> Road work ahead. I sure hope it does. Yeah, it'd be nice if the road worked. There's a particular spot I am working on getting to that I want to get a map get mapped <clears throat> since I'm here. Once I've gotten that, a lechonk. I don't have a lechonk. Catch. That is a brand new Pokemon that has been added in this release. And I've got one. I'm pretty sure they're going to be pretty common. But I might as well go on and grab a pig while it's there. this path get to if I go out through flower garden Keep hitting the wrong key for the world map because the keybinds have changed a bit here. <clears throat> Muscle memory is a thing. Let's see. Uh, 
right direction here. Whoops. There's a bigger pig. An oink alone. We'll ignore the bigger pig for right now and move on. I have a place I want to get to. Okay, here we go. This is the um, marker for the proposed landing site for the subway coming in from Lithia City, which is now on my world map. Okay. Well, I can still go to the casino. Let's try going to the casino and see what is here now. stuff. Lane block guy is here. Got a decent balance. I'm going to go on and grab claim blocks while I'm this is an idea how to stock up. <clears throat> I may need them in the very near future. It's our backpack vendor closed for now. Reading shop. Loot shop. Okay, there we go. Some of the things that, that you can pick up just by buying them outright. Shop. The evolution is still open. Rare item is still open. Where are the puffins? I thought I could buy them here. See any? Oh no. Hmm. Also, where is the Rift Traveler? That uh, speaks with. It's just the great key guy. Oops. Well, that's very interesting. I. Of course, I can't because it's in the oh, big claim for the er, er. Is there let's try the poker center. I'm looking to see if there's a reality shifter anywhere in here that somebody or am I gonna have to disconnect and reconnect to bump over to New Horizons? with like trying to find an area in the end I want to play some minecraft again sometime well this server is open let's see mines didn't work till I redownloaded 
Um. Professor Coke was here. Isn't now. It's just the hat stands. And. What if I go over here? And hopes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Running off toward focus center. Yeah, we're still in a shakedown. Uh, this config just came up, like, you know. Ah, you know. uh, that Joltik's got a shard, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to collect it. I did, in fact, collect a shard, but I could not collect the, um... Experience orbs is what it said the claim. How far out the claim goes before I can experience this. <clears throat> oh, here it is. You can hear a ding in a second. There we go. Collected. Okay. All right. It's getting to be a thing here. It's stacking. The new ones and the old ones aren't stacking. Interesting and very annoying. Oop, the you know, GTS is not working right now. All right. Um, <laughs> All right, hold on a minute. Bounce to here. This, no, this, out, and let's get all this put in. All my tunnel building stuff I'm going to put away for right now. Clear a bunch of space in my inventory. Keep that. That can. This can go shoot to the item sorter. The old shards can go up. Back. That pretty well cleared. I'm going to disconnect, reconnect, and bounce through the reality hub and over to the New Horizons world. See what there is to see. Bear is going over the mountain. At least I hope I am. Yeah. Okay. Rain. Ah. Dislike. Dislike. Portman. 
Reality selector. Let's go to the reality selector and horizons. Okie knock. Arrived at New Horizons. Whoa. Okay. Fun place. Looks like I've also arrived uh, a little bit um, up in the air. Maybe there. Okay, let's just... What do we got? There's on here. There's zoom in a little. Terralith Temperate Highlands. Spinarak. Reality selector here. Okay, there is a reality selector here. Theoretically. Ah, there's our reality selector. Okay. <clears throat> Goodness gracious, look at this place. Same in chest as previous, it's my in chest. Alright, this goes on for a while. The cats, this is huge! Oops! Not looking at all where I'm going. All right, there we go. Coming out. Nope, oh, can't do that here. Did it again. <laughs> I'm not having a, 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 any luck here. Let, let me um, just. How much further does this go? Holy cats! Looks like they might still be working on it. 
Damn it, I have schematiced in the building and didn't put anything under it. Oops. Let's just head out and see what I find. I'm finally reaching wilderness. I'm a little excited about that. Mapped my waypoints over from the other one. Which is going to be annoying. Ask. Have one of those. Excuse you. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, let's head south. That looks interesting. Oops. My compass points are uh, rotating around. Um, there we go. Do not lock north. Show me the direction I am currently going. Theoretically, that's clay ball, but... Okay. Hot up. I'm not seeing new recipes. get one of those or not. Coal. Coal is useful. Coal is always good. There's... Yeah, this is definitely... I mean, to pick up all these achievements all over again because it's a new world. Let's turn south again. Roll. 
I've got to put Jade in back here. Acacia. So it's Acacia, it's just not shaped like the Acacia that I'm familiar with. first berry. Okay, I have my first berry. I have a uh, couple of new Pokemon. Somebody so far. You start thinking about maybe making a claim. Hmm. <coughs> hmm. <coughs> get hard to see here. I don't want to miss a berry because I'm um, the dark and oh hey, let's check this page. Oh, yeah. Cautiously go around the rift here. Good stuff may have been cleaned out. I'm probably not first player. I'm normally not the first player to reach a village. Hey. I'm going to leave one of them.
Hum, hum, hum. Northeast it is. Got here a Shinx. Got one. Zeb Striker, I don't think I have any of those. Let's grab one. world it's peaceful mode I should have grabbed the bread out of that chest okay I have to take care of that now oh look hint okay that gets me two green mint leaves and two green mint seeds Hey, they've got berries growing. I need to wait here until these berries mature. <clears throat> In the meantime, oops, what did I just pick up? Eat seeds. Meh. Let us go. Check out the village. Oh, hey, nobody's been here. Emeralds, leave the sea. Need a brewing stand. Got brewing stands. Should fix this. It's kind of annoying. It has some dirt. There. That's fixed. Okay. Bread. There we go. Need that. Maps. Not so useful to me. That's just a man key, and I have a man key. said
That's interesting. What was that? A pet rat. Oh, okay. Never mind. Okay. Pretty much the end of that. And here, a mess chip. I got one of those. Oh, look here. More berries. These haven't matured either. Need to go check the ones on the other side. Garden. Oh. 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 No, it's not gonna give up the seeds unless uh matured. So yeah, that's that's just wasteful kind of harvest early. Right. Down this way somewhere. these growing wait need to hang out here till some of these berries around here mature father Awful lot of grass seed. seed. A grinball. Not what I need. Not a mom. <laughs> flowers. We've got flowers. Also got a mill tank eating the berries. That that mill tank is eating the berries. Because in the game you feed the berries to the mill tank. <clears throat> Uh, VAP? I'm, I'm sorry, VAP? I, I, I don't get. Uh, I, I, I don't understand. Vaporeon, okay. Vape for Vaporeon, okay. It's been a very long time. Sorry. Um... Yeah. Wow. This is set up in a planter made of apricot. Come on, come on. Could have brought bone meal works on these. I don't know. It's on these. I have some bone meal. Aha! Bone meal does, in fact, work. This. And I now have six hornberries. I'm going to stash these berries and Stash them in the backpack for safety. Also, the because they're gonna accumulate fast. That's a nitterin. Don't need a nit. Need to find the other berries that I had spotted. I know I found some up this way. 
growing out like in the grass, and I messed up because I tried to harvest them early. There we go. Here's this, and here's that. That's got a flower on it, and if I hit that with a bone meal... I now have Rostberries. Was there a third berry? I'm trying to remember. Yes. There is a third berry. For Sims. Okay. I think that's about what I'm going to get out of this particular village. But that's quite a lot. That's, that's a, several multiple berries and mints and some emeralds and bread and various useful things. On this way. Oop, 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 oop. Oh no. Okay, it's just a pet rat. Never mind. Thought I'd. Pardon me, getting getting excited. Savannah, or I can cross. There's berries growing over there. I see them from here. this. Medicinal leak. There we go. Medicinal leak obtained. Gyarados. We will not be involved with the Gyarados. We will... Holy cats, what was that? Not sure I want to know what that was. More orins. Okay. I'm okay with more orins. I'm going to have to figure out where I'm going to grow all these bloody berries. Just growing four of each took most of the... an obstagoon. I have battled those before. I have one in my collection. I don't need another paint. Whoops. Hi. Scyther. Don't need another obstagoon.
Not to be on sweet. Not to be sweet. And there's berries over there. Tangaberry. Coolness. Being of tangas, tangalas, whatever. Should stack. Why are they stacking? I mean, yes, it, this is being a problem in general. Some some issues with some of the. It's not one stack. It's different. Vaporeon. Okay. It's gonna be like Pido, isn't it? It's not interested in a Pido. Dealt with a Fido. Those look familiar. Persim. We have pers I have Persim. Hmm. <laughs> Decisions, decisions. See a spupa to my south. I don't have one of those. Whoops. Really me the first. Pardon me. Grabbing a little coal and a few experience orbs. Those are always useful. That shanks. Spupa. Completely missed it. Oh, here it is. What was that cry? It sounded like somebody rubbing a balloon. Orange. And it doesn't hurt to go on and grab them and see what they are, but. jungle and jungle gets a little thick whoops oh dang it wrong wrong key pineapple i already have pineapple
worth checking the river partially to see if there's any new water types. And I could look at the map. But there's also the fun of just diving into the river and seeing if there's anything in there. What do you do? Uh, okay, I got something over here. What is this? This looks familiar. Pineapple. Okay. Good. Come on. Seeing anything here I don't already have. Ponds go. Most of what I want to do is go all Linnaeus here and poke around and see what plants I can find. More interested in the plants at this point. Getting some altitude. Hoping to find it more into. Let's do daily. Yep. It means there's a little cave under. Which is where some of the shit is found. It's quite it's there. Fast way down to it. Seeing an open cave open here. I don't see much of anything at the moment. The territory is so rough. Alright, let's keep going east. And good luck with going east. Oh, what's that? A scatterbug. I don't know if I've got one or not. I'm going to grab him. Right here. I swear some of these new ones are making noises that sound like the petty freeling Saturday morning critters.
Oof. Discharge that. All the chalk. Presto. Which is them. Sure. All right, I mean. he did. Okay. Rico capture. I'm ignoring the apricorn trees because I already have apricorns back home. They're not new to this update. In the stand. It's very strange that way. Let's go that direction. Weird is, is maybe good. Let's find out. What's this over here? No leaks growing at the edge of the water. That is, that is blackstone. Holy cats, it's blackstone. We have to mine out some of this. But possibly it's it's wow, it's extensive. It's 
something down there. All right, tell you what. Six Blackstone. Got a block that's got tired. That's living cave. Supposed to be some stuff down here in a living cave that doesn't occur elsewhere. I think we've not exhausted this. To it. Stuff that's, you know, cool to have, but not what I'm here for. Isn't that just beautiful? I love the glowberries. Use them extensively in the city. Natural lighting. But then I like natural lighting like that. Um, I've never forgiven biomes of plenty for discontinuing the glow shroom bayou. That removed glow cane from the uh, from the game. That was such. A neat crop came in three colors and it glowed by itself. And then, good gosh, look at this. Came in three colors and glowed by itself, and you could uh, fill it up. Oh. Uh, you could uh, assemble it into blocks, and the blocks were like glowstone, they glowed by themselves. I use, I grew glow cane and embedded glow cane blocks in the walkways around my base so that I had the three different colors of phosphorescence. I had a whole base lit by phosphorescence. No, there were no torches or lanterns. It was all glowing and glowing fun and glowing mushrooms. And um, oh, hi, 
a flittle. I've already got one. I don't know what that is, and I want to get to find out. Ludiculo. Chillin' berry. I don't know. Chillin'? Do now. a new one. Oh, what? A chunk? Yeah, it's a chunk. Okay. Where are the pig going? Where is this thing? This did it was too many there it is, it's just a outcropping of rock. This, however. Oh, it's more. Vinipede. Not one. Okay, it's just a stone outcropping. It's got some coal. Always nice to have. Definitely mine out. I think we are about reaching a point of eating. First off, it's getting close to nine o'clock, so I've been going almost two hours. And second, reach a point. Oh, dang it. Getting the wrong F key here. Schillenberg. Gonna reach a point. She returns. Mm. This gets me a good explore into the new worlds, this new world, into some of the things now available. Sims, got them. I need a checklist. I'm going to have to set up a printer, which is going to be a pain in the butt. Already got a squawk ability. That's a blue. Apparently they come in colors. I'm going to need to print out a checklist of all the berries and mark them off as I've got them. Because, wow. There's a lot of them. It's more orange. Very, very common, obviously. Finding all the berries is going to be a challenge. Good for that. It's the sort of challenge or quest that I like. Those are sunstone. I've got a pile of them.
Okay, I'm not in the right world here. Okay. There are no warps here. Let's go here. Um, I may have a problem. Think about this. If I disconnect, I'll be able to pop back over. I should be able to pop back over. You should to ask me which world I'm gonna I want to join. Let's see if this works. Okay, I have landed here at the hub. Here and we'll go Prime Valley. Wait, see where we land. I landed in my home base. Good. Oh, excellent. This is this is brilliant. This is good. Okay. Here is some coal. Here. And we'll just drop the clay ball in there. This thing's sorted. Salt and Pata and Blackstone Plants Some Moss Carpet Fit Room for it, maybe it goes in the Duda Goes in the Duda Okay, I got some Copper to throw into the Furnace And then I've got all sorts of stuff here to sort that's going to take a little while. i got to figure out where I'm going to plant all these berries. I'm thinking I may need to expand Dylan Timmel, put on a couple of new domes, and start working there, but we'll see. I may just go down uh, underneath Dylan Timmel. That actually... Better go down below the city and put in a cavern that I can grow these all in. Mining isn't a problem. Surface area that is claimed is the problem. So, yeah. Alrighty. Well, I'm going to wrap it up here. See who actually is here. We got a got several people here, interestingly enough. So hi hi to everybody who didn't you know, who wandered in. It's not uh, anything to say. Uh sure, I can raid over to your channel. Give me just a second here. Let's see. Raid, 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 raid. Find the button here. We want to raid over to Squirrel Lily's channel. Cool. 
I'm trying to find where the button is to launch to raid over and I'm Oh come on. I'm in the stream manager. Where do I go to raid? Create a channel, add, here we go. Okay, there's the problem. I needed to... Raid channel. And we raid over to Squirrel Lily and start raid. <laughs> 